Hi, right, what's going on guys and welcome. Uh, I've got another tutorial coming at you. Uh, this time around I'll be going over the Atari Lynx and how to install it on the Nintendo Wii. Um, somebody's uh, asked me to go over this uh, as well as a few other emulators I've yet to do. So uh, the first one I decided to do is this one, the Atari Lynx. Uh, really, really easy to set up, nothing to it whatsoever. The only thing that would hold anybody back is finding the BIOS file. It's virtually impossible. I just went online earlier uh, to find a link to where I got mine at, and I can't find it anywhere. I don't know where I got it from or, or whatever, but I will include that in the download section below, guys, uh, so don't worry. Uh, Y'all can just uh, cut and paste it on the SD card, and that's it, and, and you're good to go. So uh, let's go on over to computer, guys, and get this thing going, all right? Cool. Okay guys, uh, so I'm going to show you where you're going to download this stuff from. This right here, this is my personal upload guys. Uh, it's only about 11 megabytes. Uh, now this includes the emulator, uh, all the games, and the BIOS file. I mean, it's everything guys. This is all you need right here, okay? But I'm going to show you where I got all this stuff from. This is where I got the emulator. Um, and you can come over here. If you can hit this download tab over here to, of course, download the emulator if you want. Um, the games I got from this ISO, uh, the ISO zone right here. And uh, as you can see right here, it says this set has been verified to be 100% complete. Every ROM file is included for the system. Your hunt is over. So, yeah, this is where I got mine from. They download as a zip file or whatever, and the emulator won't read the zip files. You have to unzip every one of them there's like 90 90 games or something like that um so if you want to do it that way guys you have to unzip it okay as for the bios file like i said earlier guys i have no earthly idea where i got it from no earthly idea um but here, here's your download right here this is what it will download as um let me get my uh ooh. Here's my SD card here, and I'll show you. Um, like I do in all my other videos, I'm gonna show you how to uh, install this onto your SD card, very simple. If you don't have this apps folder on your SD card, guys, simply just highlight this, just drag it on over, drop it onto your SD card. If you already have this apps folder like I have, uh, the contents of that folder right there will be copied into this apps folder on your SD card, okay? Okay. Uh, as for this, th this uh, folder here, this Wii Handy uh, SDL folder right here, will simply be copied over onto the root of the SD card. And that's absolutely it. You're ready to go. Um, here is the Lynx uh, boot BIOS file right here. This is the BIOS file right here. Um, here's all your ROMs. There's like, like I said, there's like 90 ROMs in there. Um, emulator will only read, as far as I know, the uh, LNX files, links files. And let me scroll down here. I want to show you. Okay, right here. This is the actual BIOS file that I downloaded. Uh, it says a Lynx boot image 1989 Atari Corporation. Uh, and then it has Lynx boot dot image. That's what I had downloaded right there, guys. And you simply rename it to Lynx Boot. That's all you do. So if you find this image file, put it in a safe place, guys, all right? <laughs> well, you already got it here anyway. But anyway, that's that. You're done with the computer portion of the tutorial, guys. And now we'll go over there and uh, to the Wii and see if it boots up a game, all right? Cool, man. Alright guys, so the first thing that I'm going to show you is how to install a channel. Uh, now I did go back guys and include uh, this uh, WAD, WAD file into that same download. Uh, so don't worry, the, uh, the forwarder is in the download. Alright. So uh, I use WAD Manager 1.7 to install channels. So go right into that. So we're going to hit the A button here, and we're going to select uh, iOS 2.3.6. Uh, you can you can go with 2.4.9, I believe. Um, I 
forget what other ones you can go with. It don't matter really. Just pick one. <laughs> but I, here you can select your source device, uh, USB slot, uh, USB mass storage device, USB 2.0 mass storage device, SD uh, Gecko slot A, slot B. Alright. So my wide files are on my uh, SD card, so this is the option that I'm going to select here, the Wii SD slot. Hit the A button, and then simply just navigate to wherever your wide files are at, and I'm going to my wide folder, because that's where all my wide files are at. And I'm going to go to my Master Shoes folder. I got so much junk on here, man, I swear. Alright, so I'm going to Mosey on down to the Wii Handy SDL. Right there. So, <clears throat> once you've selected it, guys, hit the A button. And then hit the A button again to install it. Once it's done, hit the A button and then hit your home button on your Wiimote. And you're good to go. And now we'll head on over to the emulator. Okay, so here's our channel here. Pretty cool little channel, really. Dark Umbra. Yeah, pretty nice. Okay, so this emulator doesn't have many options, uh, settings and all that good stuff. Uh, you have your save state, save state management, uh, auto load, auto save, blah, blah, blah or whatever. Uh, as for your display settings, you have your screen size for horizontal, vertical, uh, vertical sync, whatever that is, and maximum, maximum frame rate. So you guys just can go through here and just uh, kind of mess around with them. I'm not going to mess with it. Uh, I just leave it, leave it all the way it is. So I'm going to go to load cartridge. Uh, I'm going to play some Batman Returns. Now this is GameCube uh, controller compatible. And that's what I play with is the GameCube controller. And so there you go guys. It works just fine. Pretty neat little system actually. Alright. So there you go guys. It works uh, very, very easy to get going uh, like I said earlier uh, the only problem you guys would have is looking for the BIOS file that's it but everything else is just so simple okay so that's it guys um, I'm gonna end the tutorial right here guys and I hope it helps you out uh, whoever likes the Atari link and so uh, I'll see you guys on the next uh, tutorial, let's play, or whatever I do. And you guys have a good one. Uh, keep gaming. And I'll see you later.